god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's ISO Crazy here, and you're watching Disney Channel. Warning anything you see or hear is for entertainment purposes. If you get by her easily, please exit. But still, subscribe, boy. I ain't playing. Size gang or no gang. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Ice So Crazy. Now, before I get into story time, that clip you just saw was me after I was done recording the video the first time, and I deleted the fucking audio to it. It took me, bro. I'm not, I'm not even gonna get into that. But anyway, this is a story time. Uh. That I'm basically being forced to do because everybody want to see it, even though they was already there when it happened. So if you came up to me today talking about some, oh, Trey, you should do it three time. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's it basically. So fucking, um, here we go. This is my latest fight. This happened eighth grade year. We gonna call the dude Trevor. And the girl, Jessica. So let me give y'all some history. This nigga, Trevor, is a creep, dog. Like, bro, like he—that's his girl, but he's like he stalks her. Like he, the bell rings for her to go to her next class. He runs to her next class just to see her. And another example: when he wasn't there, when he missed a day of school, I was in her first hour of class. He called. The school, he called her first hour of class to talk to her while he was home. Come on now. Ain't no vagina never that good. But anyway, we're not even going to get started on that, coach. So, um, yeah, alright, so this happened eighth grade year. I was going into my third hour class, and she was holding her students back. So, you know how, like, with your class is bad or whatever, your teacher holds you back when the, after the bell rings. So, like, the bell rings, she tells you to sit down or whatever. So, yeah. That was happening. So, we was outside of the door. So, it was me. What's my... Uh, I'm going to call my other friend. The friend who was with me, I'm going to call him Fat Ass. So, me, Fat Ass, and Jessica is standing outside waiting for the door to open because that's our next hour class. So this nigga come bolting down the hallway, fucking grabbing on her, you know, saying all this dumb shit or whatever. I don't know who he, I don't know what they was talking about, but she walked away from it. Like he grabbed her, said something, and then she walked away. But me, I ain't gonna say we not, we ain't cool. Like I don't hate the nigga, but we don't talk. So me and a uh, fat ass, we stood up in his face, like like we about to jump or whatever. Like we just stood up in his face. Talking all types of bullshit. So, like, just, just different stuff like, oh, she don't like you. Dumb shit like that. So, after we say that, he say, uh, shut up, fuck you guys, or whatever. He say some shit like that. And he started walking away. Now, wait, let me tell you this before this. I hate fighting, dog. I really do. Like, I can fight, but I hate fighting. And... I'm not trying to be racist or stereotypical or whatever, but this is one of them nerdy white people, bro, and I do not fight people like that. So, I'm sitting down. I'm about to sit down at his desk just outside the classroom door. So, I sit down, and while I'm, like, put, about to put my ass in the chair, this nigga pushed me the rest of the way in the chair. So, me being a black-ass coon, I stood up and pushed the nigga back. So then after that, I'm not even tripping on it because he ain't said nothing. He real quiet. This nigga come up and swing on me and miss. Because, you know, <laughs> Matrix Dodger skills, nigga. But, yeah, this nigga miss. Like, how you going to swing on me when I'm not looking and still miss? So, I already told you he like one of them nerdy white people. So, I'm not really trying to fight him, dog. Like, for real. 
So I'm letting this shit slide, and she's letting her class out. I see the people walking to the door. So this nigga come back again, trying to hit me. And I'm like, bro, what is you doing? He missed again. So the third time he swung on me, alright, this nigga, he gonna try to connect one of these times. So he swung, he missed it four times. This is about to be the fourth time. He swung, missed again. I hit that nigga so hard in his fucking jaw. To where, like, he was stumbling back on a whole crowd of people that was coming out of the door. So after that, I'm really thinking it's over. I don't know, if, like, why would you, if I just hit you that hard, and I'm not even hitting you my hardest, why would you come back towards me? So he come back again. He miss. Hit him with a knocker again. So fucking the whole class is basically around us in a big ass circle. He swing again. Miss. I hit him with, bro, this fucking Rocky Balboa punch. I don't know where it came from. But that nigga end up stumbling and falling in a corner on the opposite side of the hallway. So we on one side of the hallway fight. This nigga, I hit this nigga so hard he stumbled back and go on a different side of the hallway. So after I'm like, bro, it's done. I know that shit's done. That shit's over with. That shit dead. Nigga, get up, stumbling, woozy and shit. He's still running at me trying to fight. So the, all the, like this girl came in front of me. She was like pushing me back towards his glass, and he's still charging at me. And he swung and almost hit her. So she like, she probably was like five one or something. Nigga, I reached over her so fast, hit him again. That's when the whole crowd start pushing him back. So the cops grabbed my wrist, took me to the fucking disciplinary office. They didn't even cuff me up, but they grabbed my wrist like they was about to. So I'm sitting there, less than ten minutes in, I hear some bullshit from the principal talking about he trying to press chart like whoever the lady at his house was, like his grandma or his mama, whatever, his guardian, whoever it was, was trying to press charges on me. And the school is basically, they was fighting it. Like, how can you swing first and you lose and you try to press charges? That don't work like that. So they were still talking about some, uh, y'all owe him a new pair of glasses or whatever. And I broke or bruised something between the, I don't know. I don't know. But then, anyway, after all that happened, I spent my days OSS. Out of school suspension, I spent my days ISS. So when I got back to where I can go back to my regular classes, uh, the so-called Jessica girl that he went out with that he was stalking, all of, out of nowhere gave me a hug as soon as I walked in the door. <clears throat> I was like, bro, what the fuck? But there's that story time that I was harassed about today. October 5th, 2017, I was harassed over school time. already saw. So there it is. Um, I don't, I don't got nothing else to add. So please like and subscribe, bro. Gang, bro. Gang.